Hey there guys, welcome back to another episode of Monster Super League, it's your boy Odin, and today we're back for some more Heroes Festival Summons. Um, as you guys all know, I did finally hit 1,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel, so in order to celebrate that 1,000 uh, mark or goal that I had for myself, I figured it'd be really cool if I uh, did a giveaway, and so make sure that you guys uh, comment in the section down below and subscribe to my channel as those will be the requirements for you guys to uh, essentially enter the giveaway. The giveaway is going to be for this Albatross ship that you guys see here in front of you. Um, it's got six uh, collection or resource collection areas, so all you gotta do is click the trees, you'll get some um, extra gold, energy, astrogems, fruits, etc. So uh, it'll just be an expanded ship uh, re uh, reward, and then you'll also get, I think, it's extra inventory with the ship, um, and that will be for one lucky winner. So um, in order to w enter the contest, what I would like to do on this video is just for you guys to uh, go on the comment section down below and just tell me which one of the Heroes Festival monsters is your favorite of them all. I know that there's going to be quite a few favorites towards Merlin, uh, but I know some of you guys out there are into the waifus or the husbandos, so make sure you guys let me know which one is your favorite, and make sure that you guys also tell me which element typing you think is, is better for you or which one you guys like the most. So that's what I would like for you guys to um, comment in the section down below to make sure that you guys are eligible or entered into the giveaway. Uh, and again, that's for the 1,000 uh, subscriber giveaway, um, and uh, I'll also be doing a couple more. Uh, giveaways which I'll announce in the next video. Um, there is a current giveaway uh, for a $15 Google Play gift card um, which I'll drop a link in the comment section down below to that video so if you haven't entered make sure you comment on that video and subscribe to my channel if you're new um, and also make sure to like that video that way um, it helps me out greatly just with the YouTube algorithm making sure that other people are watching my videos as well uh, but at the same time that would be an excellent way or chance for you guys to get some uh, rewards um, I did give away three uh, $15 Google Play gift cards already uh, so that that will essentially be uh, adding to that and then um, I will just stay in, stay tuned on the channel just keep be on the lookout for my videos I'll be having some more videos come out in which I'll be doing a couple more giveaways uh, just before the uh, anniversary for MSL it is going to be the fifth anniversary coming up here um, but enough talking uh, you guys are all excited for the ship I know a lot of you guys want to enter in for that so uh, congrats to all of you players that enter and good luck to all of you um, and of course, I'll be picking out, um, you know, the winner from that just randomly th from the uh, uh, YouTube comments section. Of course, you know, we'll make sure that you are uh, liking the video and et cetera. Um, but uh, yeah, so we're, I'm feeling pretty lucky today. I'm hoping to pull at least, you know, two or three nat fives and I don't know, maybe 12,000 Astro Gems, but we'll see how the luck really is. So far, I'm being very, very lucky in pulling at least three nat fours, um, you know, on some of these summons. Um, but anyways, guys, let me know in the comment section down below as well if you did summon on this festival. If you got anything nice. I know some of you guys might get some light and darks, which is really awesome. Um, I think I have, like, I started with 34,000 Astro Gems. Um, I, I think you guys know I basically skipped uh, the clan festival this past month. Um, and uh, I've just been collecting eggs from the golems and the story, essentially. Just trying to save up some gems for the anniversary. So... All right, ooh, we got finally got one Nat 4 there, so not, not looking too good so far. All right, we're about 4,000 Astro Gems in or so. Um, but anyways, guys, as I've mentioned before, make sure you guys are starting to save up for the anniversary. It is coming up here really, really soon, so make sure that you guys uh, spend your, pre your, your gems wisely um, and just save as many of them as you can. All right, we got four that round. Not bad. I mean, we're getting a lot of Nat 4s, not so many Nat 5s, though. Um, we'll see how, how good the luck is here. Banshee, Succubus, nothing crazy. All right, we're going on 5,000. Usually in the past, I've been lucky enough to pull one within six or 7,000 gems. We'll see. Wow, five now, four, now fours. That's very good. All right. But um, anyways, yeah, guys, I'm very, very excited for the anniversary. It's going to be really great. We're going to get lots of crystals from summoning. Uh, you know, as you guys all know, you'll get double uh, crystals for the crystal shop, which are great. You'll also have discounts on the uh, monthly Gleam egg packs uh, that are available from that uh, crystal shop. So make sure that you guys are saving up all of your gems for that. Don't be like me and just go all out ham on these summons. I think we're almost at 8,000 uh, summons. All right, we finally... Ooh, wow, we got a wood bast. 
I mean, it is a bass. I, I'm looking for a water bass. Um, so essentially everything, the only thing that I need out of this whole entire uh, festival. As you guys know, Acer did kind of come out and she did uh, change up the lineup for the Fire Titan very, very much so. so she's actually very good. I think I still think the Merlin uh, out damages her in uh, basically just DPS and Titans. So Wood Merlin is still your top boy, but uh, she does come in second now because she is a double courageous striker. So if you do pick one up, congrats. She is very, very good. I actually went a little bit crazy last month as well. I, I know I only did a, a couple summons or war round of the Primos on video, but I did do one more round off cam. So, oof, this is not looking too good here, guys. We're, we're burning through gems like they're absolutely nothing. So yeah, don't be like me. Don't don't be out spending your gems during this festival. Just enjoy my summons and knowing that the luck is not here this month. So make sure that you are all saving all your gems, because it shouldn't take you know twelve thousand gems to pull one at five. And unfortunately, that's what it's looking like right now. Maybe we are going too fast. Maybe I'll I'll uh, switch the stream probably back out. See if we'll get something else. All right, well, let's let's go ahead and back up. And I, I do actually have a ton of uh, eggs to open this month as well, so we will be opening up uh, quite a few of them. Let me go ahead and pop these out. Come on. We'll take a break here really quick, and we'll go ahead and, and open up some of those eggs just because um, I feel like my luck is not, not there today. So we're just going to go ahead and, and go here and just open something up. Maybe it'll, it'll give us some better luck if we clear some of the space here. I did also um, say in the beginning that I was feeling pretty lucky, but after these summons, I'm thinking it's it's not so good. <laughs> so make sure that you guys are all paying attention here closely and the fact that, um, yeah, the rates are not always very, very good. It doesn't matter who you are. It's just all RNG-based. Um, so, you know, be wary of that. Don't go in there thinking, okay, yeah, I still have a month and a half or two months to uh, gather up some uh, gems and eggs and things like that. So make sure that you're being very, very cautious with your spending oh boy come on um but yeah just enjoy my my summon video you guys can see all the pain here i'm i'm 12 essentially yeah i'm 10 000, 12 000 gems in and only pulled one egg so not not looking very good it shouldn't cost 32,000 um or th you know 34,000 gems to pull three heroes festival monsters all right so we'll open up this first egg and pray that it's a water vast come on uh, wood Artemis, okay, that's fine. I mean, I'll take it. I could use that to uh, make my dark one um, Evo 3. All right, let's see. What do we got here? Uh, th these ones, this one came from the Tower of Chaos egg, and the other one was from the Nest Pass from this month. I did get the Nest Pass just because I had two Gleam eggs this month, and, of course, Gleams are always useful. And a Wood Indra, okay. Oh, what else did I have in here? I had some gleams too. Let's go ahead and open up. Every now and then, one of these is a variant. I've, I've pulled, I don't know, maybe four or five of these the last like year or so that were variants. So there's always a small chance. I know some of you guys out there um, have pulled some variants as well because I've seen you guys post them on the Discord channel. And, and I do have a Discord channel. So if you want to, uh, you know, try your luck and open one up and, uh, you know, join the Discord channel and let us know what you pulled, that'd be really cool as well. All right, there's probably nothing in here. Of course not. Let's open up 10 more just to get the bad luck out of the way, apparently. And wow, nothing this time around at all. That's actually horrible. My, my stream it might be very, very bad. Unless there's a nat 5 here. Ooh, we did pull a nat 5. All right, there's talk about the Acer. All right, we got a wood Acer. That was from the uh, Legendary Secret Eggs. Uh, I saved a bunch of them from last month. I don't remember where they were from. I know some of them were from the, uh, what do you call it, the um, Tower of Chaos as well, too. All right, let's see if we can get back to the hero summoning. Hopefully there's a Water Blast in here somewhere in the next 10,000 gems. I don't know. If if I hit another 10,000 gems and I haven't pulled an, a Nat 5, um, I'm probably going to go ahead and just stop there. Because I, I do want to save my Primos for the uh, Clan Festival, so... Oof, these are looking pretty horrible. All right, we'll do one more, and if I don't get and if I don't get more than one at four, I'm gonna have to um, 
re just reset my seed here back out. Yep. This is a bad day. All right, let's see. Maybe if we go over here, uh, we'll reset some of that luck. All right, we're out. But yeah, guys, don't be like me. Don't spend your gems just yet. Make sure you save them for next month. September is literally a month and a half away, and uh, you'll thank yourself later um, for saving those gems. So, all right, we are 14,000 gems in with only one nat 5. And like I said, this is not looking very, very good. All right. Come on. There's got to be one in here somewhere. All right, there we go. Fire Sang Sang. No, not good. Not bueno. But at least we're 20,000 or so left. So maybe I can get the last one here in the next 6,000, hopefully. And hopefully that's not 10,000 unless 4033 changed the rates in order to get you guys to spend all your jams before the uh, anniversary. Anyways, guys, um, let me know, I guess, if you're excited for the ship giveaway. I know some of you free-to-play players out there definitely could use one. Um, so, you know, if, if you're a whale and you already have it, I mean, if you want to enter it, you're, you're more than welcome to enter it. Um, but uh, I think if, if you already have the ship and you do win, what I'll do is I'll make it so that I give you like a, uh, I don't know, maybe like a $20 or $30 Google Play gift card instead of the ship just because I do want the ship to go to somebody who actually needs it. So if you don't need it and you're a whale and you don't want to enter it, that's fine with me as well. At least you're giving the chance to somebody else out there who maybe actually needs the ship to get the ship. So, And the ship is really great, guys. I actually think it, it did give me a boost when I first started playing. I didn't buy it until I was like four or five months playing the game or so, but um, eventually I gave in. You, you need the, the space. It's just one of those things that... the more you progress in the game, the more you'll need uh, space. So, man, a lot of nat fours, but no nat fives, and we are what like oof, twenty thousand astro gems in. So definitely not a a very good rate summon here, and a water Artemis. All right, so at least we're left with fifteen thousand gems, which is, uh, I guess, decent enough for me to save another fifteen thousand before the um, next. Um, festival and of course I'll, I do have a ton of uh, nat fours that I'll have to rebirth now. Harley Quinn is around here this time guys. The dark one is actually very very good for the world boss. Um, you will need some skill books on her uh, but she's actually very very good. Her skill does require critical hit though so you know if you find uh, maybe a uh, zeal gem set which gives you 15% attack and 15% crit rate that might help you very 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 well. If not, uh, substats, if you get an enhancement that has crit rate on it, it's also very helpful. Um, what I will say, guys, is that you don't need to have a 100% chance to crit on her uh, if you're only using her for the world boss. If you're using her just for the world boss, go for like 50 or 60% crit rate and just do triple attack on her. Because the world boss it, it relies mainly heavily on skill books and attack. Um, you know, so make sure that you guys essentially just build her for, for the world boss. If you're using her anywhere else, you will be having to build her with that crit rate uh, in consideration. The water one's very, very good for the titans, especially with that leader skill, it's crit rate uh, damage, or not crit rate, but crit damage leader skill, so. All right, let's go ahead and pop open these last two. Man, and I came in all excited today thinking like, you know what, may maybe today's the day I'll finally get a water bast, but it was not happening. Now right, we got a fireball Rono which is fine, I guess. I don't really need any more Balronas. Ooh, that is nice. That I was not expecting. All right, that is pretty awesome. I am always up for some light Nat 5s because I actually don't have too many light and dark monsters, so that's very, very good for me. Let's check her out. I actually don't even know what the light saying thing does. Oh, she's a Battle Rush and Shocker. All right, that's not bad. I could use her in a arena defense. Um, already got plenty of her though, but she'll be very good SP filler for herself, just HP and uh, recovery. Uh, so all, all in all, very good. I'm very excited about that pull. Not really every day I pull a light and dark monster, although I do have quite a decent amount of light monsters now too. Oh, and I did get my light Merlin to Evo 3 last month as well. Um, and I actually think I have uh, enough points on the world boss to almost purchase a holy gleam this this um, t 
time around as well. Um, let's see, did I open up everything that I needed to do? Let's see. Well, I mean, 34,000 gems down to 15,000. I think that was like, what, like 19,000 gems or so to get all three eggs. So not very good rates, I, I would say. Um, a little bit on the lower end of rates for sure. Um, but uh, I am going to be doing another free egg summoning video. Um, I'm going to try to save that for the clan festival coming up. So be on the lookout for that. And that's the, another video which I'll do the giveaway. But anyways, that's it for my summons for this month, guys. I'll probably do the rebirths and everything else uh, off camera just because otherwise it'll be too long. Um, what I will say there, though is just make sure that you like this video, subscribe to the channel if you're new or if you want to enter the giveaway. And in the comment section, if you are entering in the giveaway, uh, make sure that you just type in your favorite Heroes Festival Astramon and make sure that you guys include the typing, whether it's water, fire, uh, wood, light or dark as well. Um, just because then I, it'll allow me to kind of differentiate, you know, stat-wise what people have as their favorite, uh, you know, monster or if any, you know, essentially I just kind of want to know what is the most useful monster you guys think. I'm kind of already thinking that one of the most liked monsters in here is going to be uh, the Wood Merlin or maybe perhaps like the Water uh, Valrona. Um, but uh, yeah, just make sure you guys can write that down in the comment section down below. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. I'll catch you all on the next video. Make sure that you entered the giveaway, and of course, make sure you hit that like button or subscribe to my channel if you're new, and make sure you join the Discord if you'd like. Uh, very good community, and they're very helpful, um, and anybody's out there to answer some questions if you're new, so uh, make sure you guys uh, let us know. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. I'll catch you all on the next video. Peace.